friends. I know somebody who wants bitches. What's poppin', what's poppin', what's poppin', man? Y'all know what time it is. Hey, we about to hit this blender and get a display going. Because I know people got guns, got chains, got shoes, got clothes, but they ain't got no, no studio display set up. You know what I mean? So go ahead, open up y'all blender. If you ain't got blender, click that link below so you can go right to the website. Get your blender. All right, that's pretty much all you're going to need right now because we're just making a display. All right. Oh yeah, unless you want an object. I'm gonna put an object in there too. So get you an object, a chain, whatever. I'm gonna do it with a gun because I'm trying to make a gun display right now. Alright, so let's go ahead and start it up. First thing we're gonna do, add our object, import object. So I'm gonna do this gun right here. So let's go ahead and add mesh plane. And then we're gonna go move this down some. We're done, so I'm gonna push S, scale it out about right there. All right, so we got a little platform for it. Now we're gonna go to edit mode and hit the back just like that. Then we're gonna exclude, put your E, then Z, so it goes straight up. All right, so you have something like that. All right, now I'm gonna push E again and push Y so we can go across the axis. All right, so right over the head of it, just like that. All right, same thing with the sides. Hit the sides, that one, then this one. Then push your E, then Y again. Push them all the way out. All right, same thing with this one. Select that one, select this one, E, Y again. Pull them over. All right, so I like if you don't have to do this part, but I like to add a little style to it. Hit this one, and this one, and slide down. Hit your move, slide down forward. All right, just to give it a little shade. You know what I mean? All right, so we got that right there. See, we already got us a box. It's inside the box. All right. So, go ahead. Go to environment mode. We're going to set up our lights. We're going to get to the dis display background and all that. But right now, we're just getting to the lights and all that good stuff. So, go ahead. Go back to object mode. And go to add. Light. Point. Pick him up. Go over, back him up, over, right here, all right, there. Then control C, control V, directly over here to the other side of him. Control C, control V, back to the middle, and then we'll turn, turn him to the back. All right, let's move these backs now. See how we got our gun display now. Moody's oh Moody's up son. So now we got our gun display. Alright, but if you want to go a little bit darker on the thing, just adjust the lights as you need it. I mean but the main thing is we got our display. Alright. Just like that. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to make little objects for it real quick. I'm just going to go ahead and add a cube. Downsize it. Go back to this mode. Downsize it.
give it a little texture. I'm just gonna make it black. So you can see I got a box right there. So let's make the box bigger than the gun. Alright, adjust it as you need it. Hopefully you already got everything exported by then by now so you can move the object if you need to you don't need it in that certain spot this is your display save so just make sure this is your display save so you can move the object around and not your main export because then you have to readjust your alignment and all that Make it lean a little bit so it can look a little real. Alright, so it's leaning against it. Now we can go ahead get us another object in there if we needed to. But I said I'm just showing y'all how to do one. So that's how you get your object right there. Let's get a picture real quick. Just to show y'all a picture. So get a camera. Hit your camera. Let's go ahead and add us a camera real quick so we can get us a picture. Uh, go ahead and add right here. Camera. Right, that's our camera right there. And we're going to hit this move. Pull it out. Go up. Back side. Right. So you can check it by just hitting your circle, I mean your zero on your, uh, what's it called, no, uh, number pad. Alright, so I'm going to move it over some. So rotate. Matter of fact, if this zoom out more, now I'm going to rotate it. I want to get the whole thing. So just make sure your scene just showing how you want because I'm having another object right here. So once you got your scene set up, you can zoom out once so you can get the whole thing and you can edit your photo. So to see the whole thing, I want to go ahead and get go to render right here, then render image. And then we're going to see when the end of the render view so we can go ahead and zoom in and all that good stuff. But you should be in a good spot as long as you move your camera right. So the only thing you need to do is probably go side to side. Don't zoom in because it's going to mess up the quality you see so just make sure you got your adjustments right your focus right on your camera all that good stuff you're gonna be straight all right but i'm gonna add another little i'm gonna put the drum magazine right here i'm just showing y'all this so go ahead hit your whatever program you got so you can take your picture and then you'll get your whole scene just like that Uh, get your go to Photoshop. Open up your picture. Oops, wrong one. Open up your picture. 
know, you can make all your adjustments right here. Blah, blah, blah. You know what I mean? But I don't use Photoshop when I make these adjustments because I'm on Windows. So I do this right here. Double click on my photo. This is if you have Windows and you're on PC like me. I don't know if they got it got it for other programs, but got it for me. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna hit hit this, edit, and we're gonna fix it, fix it up. All right, then we hit this right here. You adjust your brightness, all that good stuff. I'm just gonna put it like up a little bit, exposure, all that good stuff. Alright, once you get your photo fixed, there you, there you go. You got your photo display. Alright. Y'all got any questions though? Y'all know what to do. Join the Discord, make a ticket, and make your complaint. <laughs> no, that's funny. Go ahead and make a ticket and let me know what you need, man. I'll help you out. No, no thing to a giant. Shit, y'all go ahead, hit that like button, subscribe, all that good stuff. Appreciate y'all coming through, man. We're almost at 500 subs, man. That's all that matter. We have almost 500. So y'all keep smashing that button for me. Keep turning me up, man. I appreciate y'all, YouTube. YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. Yeah, y'all the truth, man. All right, man. I'll catch up with y'all, though. Peace. <laughs>